So I'm in a bit of a predicament here. It's time to change my oil on the scat. And as you guys can see, my car is pretty low. The next order of business is gonna be cleaning this thing. So, you know, don't worry about that. But as I was saying, you guys can see the car is pretty low, which makes changing the oil kind of a tough thing to do. I don't have a low profile jack and this ain't getting up on many lifts. So for me to be able to do it, I've done it before, but it's kind of a process and it's something that I'm not really trying to do all the way. So I'm gonna show you guys a hack actually that you could do if you have a low car and you don't feel like doing the oil yourself and you can't take it to the dealership. Cause I was gonna take it to the dealership if you guys have seen the videos and you've been keeping up. I was gonna take it to the dealership to use a coupon that I had, but they couldn't get it up on the lift. I've been able to get it up on one lift out of all the lifts that I've taken it to. And uh, the only reason I was taking it to the dealership is because I had that coupon. So with all that being said, let's get right into the video. You see, I got my oil right here and I got this off Amazon. If you guys are trying to get a good deal on some oil, I got the link down below in the description for this. I got about six one liter quarts, so six quarts right here. And then I have some leftover from the last time I did my oil change. Video on that if you wanna see it when I did my oil change on this car for the first time. They say the car takes about seven quarts, but it's a little less than that. Obviously, as you can see, I still have some from the first time I did it. So I think I should be good. We got that. Let's close this thing up give it a start because i know that's what y'all want to hear and we'll get going on to the next step So this is about to be the third oil change um, on this vehicle. Pardon me, pardon me, I had to get that out of me. Yeah, literally this month is gonna be two years exactly since I got this car. And this will be the third and the last oil change that I will be doing, because if you guys didn't know, I am selling the Scat. It is actually up for sale right now. We got a highway patrol right here just waiting to catch somebody slipping, or I don't know what he's doing. I don't think he's trying to catch someone slipping right there. Maybe he's doing some paperwork or something, but shout out to him. But yeah, the SCAD is up for sale. If anybody is interested, hold on one second. We don't want to go too crazy because you know we did just see that highway oh, patrol right there. So if you guys are interested, hit me up on IG. Link down below in the description. I got the car up on Car Gurus on Facebook Marketplace. There's a couple people hitting me up about it right now. So we'll see what happens with them. But if you guys are interested, 55,000 is the asking price. And I feel like it's very fair, especially in this market. So I am firm on that price. These cars are going for closer to 60,000 with none of what I have done to it. Uh, so you see, we got all the carbon fiber. We got several other things done as well. You see, we got the red push to start. That don't come standard in your regular scat pack. You know what I'm saying? So there's a few things that I have done to this car, made it look very good. It's an extremely, extremely beautiful looking car um, that is something i'm gonna miss i'm gonna miss the torque i'm gonna miss several things about this car but i'm excited for what the future has to offer uh it's gonna be it's gonna be dope we got some we got some crazy stuff coming we got some dope content on the way you guys you guys will enjoy it i'm, I'm sure you guys will enjoy it i will enjoy bringing the content to you but anyways as you can see we are on the road we're headed to the next step of this hack if you will you know hack for um, low car owners if you're too lazy like i am to do your own oil change i really don't want to do it right now it's just like like i said it's a whole process i don't have a low profile jack which i could just get one or i could even just borrow one from a friend but even then you know it's like I just I got everything I'm just gonna go get it done real quick sometimes time is more valuable than a little a couple extra bucks a lot of the time especially when you got a lot of things on your plate time is more valuable than a couple extra bucks forked out you know for some labor so I'm gonna show you guys a little hack obviously we got the oil right we're not doing it ourselves so you guys you can kind of put two and two together a little bit right now we're going to the the next step 
of what we got to do and uh, we'll take it from there once we once we get to that spot so I'll see you guys in a minute Man, I can't remember the last time I wasn't in a hoodie just period like in general I was gonna say in a video um, but just in general I've been in hoodies man it seems like non-stop for like months months and months but today we finally actually got a good day man you see 70 out over here in Cali I've just been super cold lately because I've been doing this like cleanse thing and I lost a little weight you know I don't have as much body fat so I've been like stupid cold appreciative of a, of a nice sunny Cali day you know where I could take the, the hoodie off for a second and um Enjoy the t-shirt weather so i just thought i would share that with you guys you know i'm, I'm enjoying this t-shirt weather hopefully you guys are enjoying whatever type of weather you're having right now and uh hopefully you guys are having a great day man hopefully everybody's having a wonderful day out there i feel good today hopefully you guys are still on your grind i know um we were talking a lot about the new year resolution a lot when the new year begun and i was saying how uh, you shouldn't let that initial motivation and inspiration go away. So hopefully you guys haven't let that go away Hopefully you're still on the grind and still hunting and still after all your goals And hopefully you're you're getting there too. I got faith in you guys and I know you guys can accomplish anything you want in life Just just like myself man. I have extreme confidence in you just as I do with myself Right there i don't like those those new beamers the new m3s do not do m's justice i'm sorry if you have one i'm sorry but uh i do not like them as you can see we're here at the dealership this is the next step of the process you see they got the cherokees right here i always like to look and see what they got on the lot because you know nowadays ain't really too much going on for newer vehicles this one's been here for a minute it seems i think i seen this last time i came pretty cool color they got a few challengers this is a cool rubicon is that a wrap or is that an actual like color that it comes with just an oil filter no oil yeah just the filter anything else no, nah, that would be it. Yes, sir. 1196 is your total, please. Oh, that sounds good. <laughs> yeah, Bobby, don't tell him that. Get a signature on there, please. Could have been touring with you uh, with Weird Al. Have a good day. Thank you, sir. Have Thank a good day. Get the hell cat. slowing down then so I'm sure you guys figured out by now what we were doing at the dealership we went to go get a oil filter and now we will be off to the next step if you guys are putting this all together drop a comment down below let me know if you already know what we about to do there's a lot of no's in that huh but uh yeah man if you guys know what we about to do drop a comment down below and while you're at it if you guys enjoy the content if you find it helpful if you just want to support the channel and support the kid you could also drop a like and subscribe that does help out tremendously and i appreciate it greatly oh, my guy getting this little workout in just a little change yeah, just the little thing. Signature okay. Yes, sir. So as y'all can see, I'm at Walmart. Basically, why I'm at Walmart is because they have, um, they don't have a lift system with the, the way that they do oil changes and stuff. You just drive it in, and basically they could go under and get to everything they need to get to. So they don't have to lift the car up, which is dope. Hence the reason I came to Walmart with my oil, with the oil filter and all that. Um, because basically as long as you have that stuff, they'll just charge you the labor. And I'm sure you could do that anywhere that's able to, you know, get your car up off the ground. Or in this case, like I said, they don't have to get it up off the ground. They have a better way of doing it. A couple extra bucks 
uh, for the labor and I don't really have to worry about it. So like I said, man, sometimes time is more valuable, you know, for, I don't know what, at least an hour and a half of my time, maybe even more because like I said, it's a process. I'll take that. Good, how are you? Good, right? Yeah. I recognize you from your YouTube channel. Oh yeah? Yeah. Appreciate that, man. man. Thank you. Twenty minutes later. And there it is. That is the hack. My car is done. I waited what like twenty minutes. Thankfully, I got here and there was there wasn't a wait. So you see, we got the hundred percent oil life once again. So the new owner of this car is gonna have a fresh oil change. The tags literally freshly paid because I bought it in March. Got to pay it in March. Brand new tires, Advan Apex. Those aren't cheap tires, you know, those are pretty good tires. So it's pretty much set up, man. Whoever's getting this car, you don't have to worry about nothing. So that was my little hack. Uh, let me know down below in the comments if you would rather just do it yourself or if you agree that sometimes your time is more valuable than uh, 30 bucks. You know what I'm saying? I don't mind paying 30 bucks to save myself a little bit of time. And I got a video out of it. You know, I already did the video of me changing it. So now we got one of a little hack for people with lower vehicles that you can't go into the dealership. And usually I wouldn't go to the dealership, but like I said, I had the coupon to get my oil changed and all that for like, it, it would have came out to be cheaper than me doing it myself. But this was what, I spent 50 bucks or so on the oil. I spent 12 bucks or 10 bucks on the filter so that's 60 bucks 30 bucks on the change 90 bucks not too bad you know so all in all i just had to pay 30 extra bucks and i saved some time walmart is the good one to go to because that you could just drive in they don't have to lift it up or anything at least that's how it is with the walmart that i have i don't know about your walmart but you could call around and see of a place that has you know, either a low profile lift, cause I have been able to get it up on certain lifts or a place where you just drive in like this. So it comes in handy. Somebody is blowing up my damn phone right now. It's probably one of them group chats. You guys already know how that goes. That's pretty much gonna do it for this one. If you guys enjoy, like, comment, subscribe. It helps out tremendously. I appreciate it greatly. All links to everything I use and recommend are down below in the description. The gaming channel is down there if you guys are into that. All social platforms down below in the description. The 1391 merch and apparel. If you guys wanna support the kid go check it out 1391.com i appreciate you guys until the next time your boy louie checking out salute Should go to Costco right now. I gotta go. God damn it. I think I'm gonna have to make that trip. You know when you wanna go home? Cause I do have to edit this video as well, but I do have to go to Costco. And I'm right here. Might as well just get it done.